Shots fired into an Indianapolis home. A family arrived to find bullet holes all over their walls. Now, as police investigate, the family wants to know who did this and why. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Debbie Knox. And I'm Bob Donaldson. CBS 4's Lindsay Eaton spoke with the people who live there about this terrifying discovery. Right above the couch and inches away from a framed symbol of their faith is a bullet hole. The first emotion that comes to mind is anger. Vincent Hicks, his fiance and her six year old daughter live in this home off East 24th. Sunday night, they got home around 11. Just went out to go do some laundry, came back, you know, saw a hole in the walls like that, definitely wasn't here. We left. Hicks quickly realized this was just one of many bullet holes. The first thing I checked was our house. I came to the back, I noticed, you know, it's just riddled right here. And Hicks's home wasn't the only one hit. Take a walk with me just a few feet away. His neighbor's home. You can see three bullet holes in the window there, and those are just a few of the shots that hit this home. So it was intentional. They were very intentional. They wanted somebody to hurt at the end of the day, and I don't even think they care who. Hicks has no idea who would do this. There's an alley behind the homes and thinks perhaps this is where the shooter or shooters came from. It lines up with the bullet holes. Somebody's going to watch this. Some kids going to watch this. They going to know who did it or maybe they did it themselves and they going to think that they dope or they going to think they did something. Hicks knows this could have been a very different story if his family was home during the shooting. I'm taking it personally. He wants whoever fired these shots to realize the choices they make have permanent consequences. It just takes a millisecond to end somebody's life. On the city's near northeast side, Lindsay Eaton, CBS 4 News. Hicks did file a police report IMPD is investigating. He's also working with his landlord to find a new place to live. Well, we are learning.